Hey collective, what's up? Welcome back to the channel. It's your girl, Earth Angel 111. Today we're gonna do love messages only from your person. So let's see what they wanna say to you today. This could be whoever's on your mind, whoever you're thinking about at the time you see this message. So a few popped out there. We'll start with these, but we're gonna get a couple more. Okay, beautiful. First message is blessing, so your person can see that you guys are about to receive something and if not they can be the one that wants to bring in something for you guys top of the deck is in the next few days so this could be something big happening for maybe you and your connection Ooh, so we've got i often write you out a message and then delete it before pressing send i don't want to say or do the wrong thing so if this is someone new in your life, they could be a little bit insecure, or if not, they just think you're top tier. So this person in mind really just wants to make sure when they approach you, if they haven't already in a sense of wanting to date, they want to make sure that they start on the right foot with you guys. Some of you guys, this could be a friend of a friend, maybe you just casually met. For others of you, this could be a coworker, or this could be just someone you've met online. You'll know how it resonates for you guys. So we've got heavy chemistry. I feel like for some of you, you definitely know this person since you can feel there's a heavy chemistry between the two of you. Could be a lot of flirting, could be a sense where this person really just likes to like light up your world. This person thinks you're absolutely gorgeous. If you're feminine, if you're a masculine, absolutely handsome. But yeah, they're very attracted to you guys. So they wanted to let you know there in that message. We're gonna get one more and then I'll get into it. Love language is physical touch. Okay, so how you're going to know this person's into you is they could definitely be someone who, when you guys communicate, they are very hands-on. And if not, this is how they will be when it comes to you guys. This person is going to be very lovey-dovey with you and also just like very sure of your connection so you guys expect someone to come in in the next few days and maybe open up to the fact that they want to be with you guys 222 is just on the reading this could be a twin flame and if not it's like this is a person who sees you as a genuine long-term partnership <coughs> okay so we have a message <coughs> <coughs> excuse me coming in from this person it's got like a dry cough there so maybe <laughs> this person feels like choked up like they don't know what to say if you know this person already in person like you see each other quite frequently you could make them like at a loss for words when you two encounter each other they could be really stunned by your looks as well so maybe when they come across you they're like choked up like i almost just got there totally just like winded is what i'm hearing so wow you give this person a lot of butterflies we've got a message here and it says my dearest love have i ever told you how much i knew you were meant to be an important part of my life from the moment i met you beautiful it says there was just something different about you that caught my eye like no one ever has before i want to be committed to you i hope you feel the same so whoever you're dealing with, this person definitely wants to have a long-term commitment with you. Maybe previously, this is someone who didn't see themselves having marriage or love or long-term. This could be someone who was more of like a bachelor, bachelorette type. But when it comes to you guys, you've awoken this person. You've awoken them to the fact that they've got more issues to work out when it comes to commitments but when it comes to you guys they're willing to work through anything so we've got sometimes i wish we had better communication between us i shut down emotionally exactly so whoever you guys are dealing with it's like this person is acknowledging that they are literally how i was like choked up like they don't have much words they're not sure how to process how they feel about you or communicate it rather i think this person has a deep knowing that they want to start some type of commitment with you but i'm really getting that this is someone off the ground that you guys haven't dated you guys haven't reached that level of closeness or intimacy even i want to say and so yeah when it comes to you and this person 
you've really changed their world in some sense. So you are my everything. Aw, and you guys saw that flip out. So this person definitely knows that you are worth settling down with. And it's like they could have a lot going on in their world. But they're willing to make the time for y'all. This is someone you're dealing with who could be a bit of a go-getter. I'm hearing they could be really busy. They could be really focused on career, their own self, building themselves up. This person could be someone who doesn't often commit, but when it comes to you guys collective, it's like you broke through all the emotional barriers that this person has been holding within themselves and now they are ready to give to y'all. And this is a huge shock. I feel like you guys either won't see this coming, how emotionally invested this person is, or the fact that they're already feeling so deeply for you guys. Because this could be someone who plays really hard to get themselves or like I said, just non-communicative, very much so keeps their emotions deeply hidden. Based on the energy I'm getting here, you could definitely be dealing with an air sign or a earth sign. Because water signs are very much so open with their emotions and fire signs are very passionate and driven with their emotions. Unless you're dealing with an Aries, sometimes Aries can be a little bit aloof. They either love you or they love to stay away from you. <laughs> So definitely if you resonate with any of those signs, you know your person is really picking up heavy air energy. So Gemini, Libra, Aquarius or uh, Earth energy, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. And like I said, possibly an Aries. So we'll get a couple more here. We've got I'm unsure how to approach our connection lately. So if this is something that's gone full swing rather quickly your person is really confused how they can show you how much they're into you and so this could keep pulling them back emotionally as well kind of keeping you both in this state of confusion when it comes to this connection this is a new chapter though in your life in this person's life so it's almost like up to them to really just dive deep into what they're feeling for you guys and move forward from there I feel like whoever you're dealing with has to really just sit down and tell themselves they can commit. They're ready for a long-term relationship. And this could be someone who has a hard time doing that based on their past, based on possibly being hurt previously. Okay, so one more message here. It says, you are enough. Beautiful. I love how an angel message snuck in. See, I feel like this is for your person, though. It's like I get the sense that they're either just unsure of how to approach you. You could definitely resonate with being a divine feminine, divine masculine, someone who's very self-aware. You could have your own thing going on. You're very self-made. And so when it comes to you guys, this person, their angels or your angels sending them extra guidance at this time. We've got your angels are sending you protection, love, and light. If you recently faced some sort of rejection, know this was divine protection. So this is for your person more so as well. In the past, they could have been in a relationship or a connection that didn't work out. And when it comes to now moving forward, it's like, in specific, this person has to just be aware of the energy that they're in, right? And for a lot of you guys, this person has really held themselves back when it comes to committing to a partner in general. And so now they're at the point in their life where they need to realize how much they have to offer in a connection. And this could be a bit of time. I feel like if you've met this person and it's been really slow moving, it's like a slow burn when they're all in. They're going to be super committed to you. But that build up to get there, it's like slow and steady wins the race. I feel like this person could definitely um, have some type of hesitancy when it comes to dating based on their past. But when this person does commit to you, love language is their, their um, physical touch. So they're going to be very handsy, hands on, holding hands, cuddly. Hugs all the time, kisses. Like this person's going to be very giving towards you in that sense. 
just approach them with ease. I feel like your looks or your smile alone really just makes this person feel more comfortable. They're drawn to you. So if you're feminine, it could just be the way that you carry yourself, very much so in feminine energy. Or if you're masculine, this person could really admire the fact that you are an alpha, right? Um, something more like protective and masculine and however it resonates, it's like you'll know which side you're on, who you're dealing with, right? This is a collective general reading, but it's like this person really is coming to terms with the fact that when they're around you, you make them feel a certain amount of peace and this person may have not felt this with anyone ever. And so this could be really something eye-opening in their life to realize that the connections they were previously in as well could have been more materialistic, 3D based, shallow based, looks based, not on a deep emotional sense and connection. And that makes a lot of sense why when you first met, this could be how they were attracted to you because they are breaking a cycle, you guys. This person is someone who previously always dated based on a physical chemistry that was most important to them. And then those relationships never lasted because once that fizzle faded out, they were left wondering. When it comes to you guys, they could feel like you're very attractive, but they also know that you have a lot more to offer them than just looks. You are someone who is going to be reliable, loyal, dependable, stable, loving, giving, caring. And you know, when it comes to all those things, there's nothing more you could ask for in a partner respectable and loyalty top tier y'all so yeah i feel like whoever you're dealing with in this connection give them some time let them ease into it but this person's definitely going to come forward and let you know the extent of how much they love you so i'm going to get one message here we've got breath of the cosmos my will to thy will micromanaging the universe so at this time, you're being told to let go, trust in divine timing, don't put so much pressure on when this person's going to come forward, just know they're going to, and I feel like you should really almost pull back your energy to give them space to like appreciate you guys, to miss you, to value you, and to realize how important this connection is to them, because if you do so, they're going to see and realize in their own heart and mind that this is more than just a physical attraction. So I hope this could resonate for you guys and bring you a little bit of peace. This is the messages currently from your crush or the person on your mind. Thank you so much for watching y'all. Till next time, Earth Angel 111, peace.